money, for business, for all types of abuse and exploitation. And that's how I felt. That's uh -huh. how I felt. Hmm. So what about the, the last album? The, there is a story behind it. Well, that's a very good example. You, know, uh -huh. you, you basically hit the nail straight into the wall. You know? yeah. And this last album, Without You, um, that was released by my former record company, mm -hmm. is basically an album that consists of A, demos, okay. unfinished uh, demos, leaked MP3 demos, B, unfinished material, that although may sound okay, but it's mm. unfinished. I never gave my blessing, never approved my, gave my approval. Three, or C, sorry, um, <laughs> I got mixed up. C, uh, there are sketches and ideas that uh -huh. I would have never released, never. So with the release of that album, I mean, as soon as it came out, I asked all my supporters to boycott it and not, not to buy it because mm -hmm. it's a prime example of what I'm talking about, the commercialization of me and my brand, how I've become. Okay. It's very much like um, you got a bunch of chocolates, and amongst the chocolates, mm -hmm. you have Cadbury. You know, you have I don't know, you have uh, Mercedes Benz. You know, mm. so among the cars, let's say I'm like tier number one, and the money needs to be made. You yeah. know, in my domain, in my area. So it's very unfortunate because we're talking. When I came into all of this, I had you know. I came in so very you had pure. no idea about this when you first came into this industry? There was no industry. Mm. There was no industry. When I came into it, it was 100% I mean like pure. This, uh, it, it was pure. There was no such thing. Okay. There was no such thing as... But since you were producing before, so you were in this music thing... And different you genre, different music, different okay. style. Islamic music as we know it today, mm -hmm. like Al Mu'allim, Hasbi Rabbi, and, and it's a new thing. It didn't exist, you know, it, unless it's for a niche, you know, mm. some people, religious people, you know, okay. who listen to it. But the mainstream, main, making it mainstream, having it on TV channels like Mazika, Melody, um, MTV, you know, in, in Turkey they have Kral, which is the equivalent mm. to MTV. Uh, you would never find that. You'd okay. never find a religious themed song being played uh -huh. um, on those channels. So that started in 2003. And because of that, it's, it created an industry. It created a whole influx of artists coming in, which is fine again. But somebody like me, you know, I just feel like, you know, there were some things that happened, but it's okay. We, we learn and, and we move on. I ask my supporters not to buy this album without you. Uh -huh. Those who are watching, those who are listening. So are you going to like redo your own album with the same uh, I'm going to release songs? the real third album, okay. the official album, the album that will be my album. The same songs? Some of them. Okay. A few of them. Not all of them. Because as I say, you know, the demos and unfinished. Uh -huh. and so can, can we listen to one of these songs that will be in the new album? You want to listen to one of the yeah. songs? Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, one of them is called Without You. It's mm -hmm. one of my favorites. Um, and it goes something like... Uh, mm, so you might see Just what your lover's meant to me and what the cost of losing you would be. No, I don't know where I would go, what I would do without you, without you, without you. So the new album should be released. Uh, do you have a specific date for it? Um, I hope, inshallah, it's spring 2010. Mm -hmm. um, We'll have to see how it, how it develops. I'm a bit of a perfectionist, you see. I, don't, I, I take my time with okay. my, my music. I compose my music, I play the mm -hmm. instruments, I arrange, and I write the majority of the lyrics. So, so you're a songwriter, a musician, and a singer. And I compose my music okay. as well. And I often play the instruments. Not because of any particular, you know, I, I have to do it, but because I feel like I have more control, I know exactly what I want, mm. and uh, I just work on it. I work as hard as I can to make it sound right. Okay. And the rest is, you know, when you work from here, the rest is from up there. <laughs> Sammy, we're going to take a short break and okay. then we'll continue. Faster Woman TV. We once had a teacher, the teacher of teachers. He changed the world for the better and made us better creatures. Oh, Allah. 
we've shamed ourselves, we've strayed from a Surely we've wronged ourselves, what will we say in front of it? He was Muhammad Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam Muhammad Mercy upon mankind Teacher of mankind Aba al-Qusim Ya Habibi ya Muhammad Ya Shafi'i ya Muhammad خير خلق الله محمد يا مصطفى يا إمام المرسلين يا مصطفى يا شفيع العالمين يا مصطفى Until he breathed 